Hi, we're here at the New York Women in Film and Television 30th Annual Muse Awards held at the New York Hilton, and we're here with Marsha Hunt. She is uh, receiving the 5th Annual Lorraine Arbus Award. Congratulations. Thank you. It's an extraordinary award. You know, I only know this remarkable lady, Lorraine Arbus, on the phone. We've had one very good phone visit. But uh, since our talk on the phone, I've read about her and uh, kind of checked up on whom I had just met on the phone. She's a remarkable woman. She's had an impressive career professionally and still is in the midst of it, which I'm told is why she can't be here today. But also she's filled her life with concern for others, particularly the disadvantaged, people who have to live with a handicap. And her work in that field is so impressive that I think the award rightfully goes to her. But she instituted this award in her name, and I'm terribly touched to be the object of it. Well, congratulations. It may, I may mention your, your age. You look fabulous. At 93 year old, you're an actress and lifelong humanitarian and social activist. Thank you so much. I may be the oldest person at the luncheon, do you suppose? Well, you look fabulous. <laughs> Thank you. I'd put you in your 70s. Oh, well, I wouldn't know where to put me. I'm just enjoying every day. I have been blessed with good health and enough energy to keep going. I don't see or hear as I used to, but who does at this age? Have you encouraged any of your family to go into the business, or are they? I have a nephew, I have no children of my own, but I have a nephew, Alan Hunt, who is a very gifted director, has done about every musical I've ever heard of, and a great deal of Shakespeare, and he he's a remarkable talent. He doesn't do film or television, he does live theater. And he's brilliant at it. He's also very talented as a performer. What kind of advice can you give to any kind of uh, aspiring actor or actress? Oh, it's hard to give advice to performers because it's so desperately crowded a field. And I thought, well, the first thing is get a good day job. Find some way to pay the bills because you can't count on these performing arts. They do not pay the rent or the food bill. But after that, get good at something else besides what you do in the arts. And then hang in there. <coughs> Excuse me. Hang in there if you can. And if, if, I don't know, if the gods are with you, they will smile. And you will at least have the joy of nurturing a talent in a field that brings such pleasure to everyone. It's a privilege to be in the performing arts, and I loved six Broadway plays I've done, 62 movies, and I never counted the TV. Every one of them was a joy. So hang in there, but get a good day job. Well, it's a pleasure and an honor to meet you, and congratulations again on receiving this award. Thank you so much. It's a joy to be here. Hi, we're here with Cindy Berger, Chairman and CEO of PMK BNC Public Relations. Congratulations, you're one of the honorees today at the New York Women in Film and Television uh, Muse Awards. Yes, it's very exciting. It's uh, um, uh, a tremendous honor. I've been to these events before and I never thought that I would be uh, sitting on the dais with incredible women. So um, uh, I'm very honored. Now, you're uh, one of the foremost publicity agencies in the entertainment industry with offices in New York. York and Los Angeles. Right. We have um, I've about a hundred, about 110 people in LA and about uh, 55 people in New York. Uh, and we're a multi-specialty shop. We handle actors, actresses, film directors, producers, uh, uh, television shows, rock stars, and we also have corporate and branding uh, departments and events. So uh, it is a multi-specialty shop. What do you attribute to your success? It's very competitive out there. Uh, 
it is competitive, but um, I can tr I, I attribute the success to uh, certainly um, the hard work and dedication of staff that care about their clients uh, and have um, uh, been loyal to the company. And I've been loyal to the company. I started out as the receptionist, and now I'm chairman and CEO. So uh, that speaks volumes. At least I hope it does. That's fabulous. How long have you been? When were you? Um, I started out fresh out of college, so I'm there roughly about um, uh, 20 plus years. I started out in their toddler program. Well, congratulations. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Hi, we're here with Pat Sweeney Kaufman, director of the New York State Governor's Office for Motion Picture and Television Development and Deputy Commissioner of the Empire State Development. Congratulations. You're one of the New York Women in Film and Television honor, uh, honorees today. I'm so excited. I've come to this luncheon for the entire 16 years and I've been in this job. Never, ever did I think that I would be one of the women that would be up there speaking as a muse. So this is really a thrill. We met you originally at the Hampton International Film Festival this past October, I believe it was, at the Founders uh, Party out in the Hamptons. It's a pleasure meeting you there. And what a great festival that is. And I mean, one of the great, great uh, pleasures of my time as film commissioner in New York is that I've been able to be on that board. And that is just one of the wonderful film commission, one of the fi wonderful, wonderful film festivals that the state offers. So you've done a lot. Have you mentioned about the two billion uh, tax incentives and everything? Oh, I think the thing that we're all most proud of is the fact that we've passed the New York State 30% film production credit. We passed it in 2004. It's grown ever since then. It's gotten bigger. And just in this past year alone, our incentive program brought in almost two billion dollars in production in New York. So it's pretty exciting. Well, congratulations again on being honored. Big, big honor. And uh, have a great time today. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. I'm so glad you're here. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Good. And I'll see you at the Hampton. Great. <laughs> Thank you. Have Thank fun. You.